What's going on everyone? My name is Nick here at ClickUp and today I want to talk about adjusting the settings for your Click apps and your integrations from within the platform. As many of you might know, inside traditional project management software, you're not given much options to really customize your workspace. You're not allowed to remove or adjust features in a given platform. And because of that, that can lead to inefficiencies and a lot of things that you really just don't need in your given workflow. Well today I'm going to be showing you just how much ClickUp believes in both customization and making your workflow work for you. So today, let's go ahead and dive into how to adjust Click apps and integrations inside the platform. So in order to adjust the settings for your Click apps as well as your integrations, we want to start off by going to the top right hand side of the screen and clicking on the user profile icon. And then after that we're going to go down to settings and then go to the far left side of the screen and click on Click apps. And once we've done this, we're now in a window where we can see all of the variety of ClickUps that ClickUp offers that allow you to stay more productive. For example, we have multiple assignees, due dates, time tracking, priorities, tags, and so many more that we have coming down the pipeline in the next coming months. Again, we're trying to find as many ways to keep you productive on the platform. And we're not going to simply put out one or two new features each year. We want to make sure to provide all the functionality you'll need. So this is really just the beginning. But what's great about all of this is that we can actually see what spaces are using each click app. So for example, we can generally see that on four spaces, we're using multiple assignees out of all of our spaces. And down here with tags, we're only using tags on one space. To see what spaces are using these, we just simply click here and we can see exactly which ones are using which click apps. So with a purple check mark, we can tell that SEO, IT, PB Crackers, and Seafood are all using our current multiple assignees click app. Well, let's say for example that on PB Crackers, I wanted to go ahead and remove multiple signees. It's a simple click. And now if we go back and check, it's not using it anymore. And if we want to put it back on there, it's a simple click just like how we removed it. And it works the same way for all different click apps. So again, it's very easy to adjust, very easy to set for what standards we want. And it lets us operate on a space-based level rather than on an overall team level. So if on some spaces we want some more complex features, we can have that. If we want a space with no complex features, usually maybe on something like a to-do list, we can set it to that. So like I said, it's completely customizable. What's nice is you can see a list of all the new click apps right here. And then also we can go over to our integrations page. Now we have things such as GitHub and Slack as integrations. And with our public API, you can build your own onto the platform. Along with that as well, we have things like Zapier and a multitude of other integrations coming down the pipeline that we've gotten lots of requests for on the platform. So we're going to make sure to deliver on those promises. Outside of that though, click apps again are very customizable and we can even break down to the individual space level and start to see which ones are using which. So as you go down here, you can click on an individual space and see which ones are using it. And by simply flicking it, you can confirm to disable and remove a specific click app that you don't want to use anymore. So again, it's completely customizable and you use it to your will. Now keep in mind when you do disable a click app, it's not just removing it from an individual space, it's removing it from the overall team. So if we want to turn it back on, just like that, it's enabled in the spaces, and then we choose which ones we want to have that given multiple assignees feature on. All right, so that's pretty much how you adjust all the different click apps inside ClickUp as well as your integrations. If you have any more comments, questions, or concerns on the topic, please feel free to leave a comment down below or contact us personally at help at clickup.com. We're always here to help. Anyways, everyone, that's it for the video. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video. Stay tuned.